colleague of mine, Dr. George Slavich at UCLA Stress Lab, has said that stress is on everyone's mind, but in no one's medical chart. Um, and I think about that a lot as providers, as patients, as people. We, we know just intuitively that stress physiologically disrupts our physical and mental health. Um, but right now, there seems to be a little bit of a a chasm or like a black hole, right? If if we see people with chronic headaches or stomach aches or pain, um, they're often told it's not medical, right? But but we actually know that prolonged activation and stress response can lead to disruptions in our neurologic endocrine metabolic immune pathways, right? This includes pain pathways, reward pathways, chemical signals to our gut and our digestion system that could affect obesity, right? And heart disease and, um, and all these functional uh, syndromes. Um, and so the good news, though, right, is that we actually do have evidence-based and evidence-informed strategies that counter that stress response. <music>